Lenovo is hoping to find the same success with the latest addition to the series, the Vibe K5 Note. With upgraded hardware and a premium design, does the latest affordable smartphone from Lenovo prove to be a worthy successor? We find out, in this comprehensive Lenovo Vibe K5 Note review. The Lenovo Vibe K5 Note features a full metal unibody construction. Admittedly, it doesn't feel like the highest quality metal when compared to its more expensive and higher-end counterparts, but the construction is sturdy, and the device feels solid in the hand. Taking a look around the device, the headphone jack sits on the top, while the micro support can be found on the bottom. The hybrid dual SIM card and microSD card slot are on the left side, and on the right is the power button and volume buttons. The buttons are definitely an improvement when compared to its predecessor, with a good amount of travel and a nice click to them. With a 5.5-inch display, the K5 Note is a large device, but Lenovo has done a good job with keeping the bezels along the sides of the display relatively thin. The subtle curves all around the back contribute positively to the handling experience as well. However, the metal body makes for a very slippery device which can take some getting used to. If you have had issues with dropping your phone, you are definitely better off using a case that adds some grip. The Vibe K5 Note comes with a 5.5-inch IPS LCD display with a full HD resolution, resulting in a pixel density of 401 pi. This display is a huge improvement over its predecessor, particularly when it comes to the brightness. Color reproduction and viewing angles are better as well. 1080p allows for plenty of sharpness, and reading text, watching videos, and playing games are all enjoyable on this large display. One point to keep in mind here is that the glass panel protecting the display isn't of the Corning Gorilla Glass variety, which is definitely a step back, considering it was available with the K4 Note. It's difficult to judge how sturdy the panel is without actually scratching it or dropping the phone, but if that is a worry, a regular or tempered glass screen protector is certainly recommended. That said, I haven't had any issues with scratches on this screen yet. The Vibe K5 Note is powered by the Octa-Core MediaTek Helio P10 processor, clocked at 1.8 GHz and backed by the Mali T860 MP2 GPU. This particular review unit comes with 4 GB of RAM, but there is also a slightly cheaper version of the phone available with 3 GB of RAM.